If you are a nonprofit or an individual that is looking to support your local cause, you might need new and engaging ways to raise funds for your nonprofit organization. Hi, I'm Chrissy with Funds to Orcs. And I'm Eric, a random stranger. <laughs> And if you're like us, there are many causes that you love to support and you probably need some new ideas. So today we're going to break down our top five favorite unique fundraising ideas. So especially in this day and age, nonprofit fundraising ideas need to be fresh, creative and fun because people don't want to just get money right out of their wallets for no reason. People want to have fun while they're donating towards a cause they care about. Like for me, every time I buy dog food or cat food or go to the ASPCA, I always donate money because I care about animals. I personally love to support our local women's shelter, the World Wildlife Fund, and the Trevor Noah Foundation. See, and people care about those things, but in order to get people to donate for causes they care about, you need to stay fresh and engaging. Especially in the digital era. So we have five ideas that might change your world. Number five is a sip and paint class. You may be seeing these things popping up everywhere because they're becoming super huge. Everybody likes to be creative. And everybody likes to drink their beverage of choice, whether it be coffee or juice out of a giant bottle. But what you want to do is ask a local artist to donate their time to teach a sip and paint class and ask your supporters to either bring their beverage of choice or provide it for them. This is one of my favorite ideas because I love painting and art therapy. And I think this is a great way to engage a lot of different types of supporters. Yeah, and basically what you do is you ask your supporters to donate for the sip and paint class. And the cool thing about this is too, after they're done doing the paintings, you can ask them to donate their paintings, the supporters, to be sold at an auction or to be sold for your charity. So not only do you make money from the sip and paint class, but you can make fundraising money from the paintings as well. Number four, you guys have all probably heard of this before, 5K races. Now, a lot of- should that as number five. Continue. Okay. <laughs> a lot of major organizations use 5k races to support their causes that are health related such as cancer or ALS however a lot of smaller nonprofits can help generate some fundraising dollars with a 5k as well there's multiple avenues of revenue stream here first you can have the runners pay a small registration fee two you can have businesses support your runners and sponsor the race three you can also collect shoes for a shoe drive fundraiser at the race. And four, you can sell related t-shirt items and any other merchandise that you might be selling for your causes. Number three, a video game tournament. A lot of people don't realize that most millennials and Generation Z people play video games, not just videos. And this is actually a really easy thing to get set up. All you need is a couple of new consoles like Xbox One or PlayStation 4, even a bunch of computers. You get a current game like Super Smash Brothers or Overwatch or even Mario, Mario Kart, Kart, and you set up a tournament. You have people pay a registration fee, you have a couple prizes, and you have them donate their money towards your cause. And a lot of people that might not do a 5K would definitely do a video game competition. So you can get new supporters for your cause and generate a lot of revenue. Also, another idea is you could stream your competition and make money that way off of Twitch or YouTube. Time together, Inception style. Number two, matching gifts. So many nonprofits out there miss this opportunity to make some effortless fundraising dollars. Yep. Corporations provide social good opportunities for their employees, which can mean significant money for your nonprofit. Now, if you're ready to get started on a matching gift, Double the Donation has one of the most comprehensive databases out there and can help you find matching gift programs. And then all you have to do is promote on your website and social media that there is a matching contribution opportunity that will double or sometimes triple your donations. That's three times or, or twice. And then our number one fun idea for raising funds for your nonprofit is a, a shoe drive fundraiser. With funds to orgs. I don't know. <laughs> A shoe drive fundraiser is an awesome event that doesn't require you to buy or sell anything to raise money. You don't have to ask anyone to open their wallets, you just have to ask them to clean out their closets. Give them your shoes. This can be started as a standalone event or it can coincide with other events you have throughout the year of your fundraising calendar. Like do a 5k, give me your shoes. Spill paint on your shoes, give me your shoes. As long as it's <laughs> cleanable paint. Don't say give me your shoes, say give me your shoes please. That's what <laughs> be nice. Be nice. What's great about a shoe drive fundraiser is that it's a win-win. For all the shoes that you provide, Funds to Orcs will pay you by the pound for the shoes, and then those shoes go on to micro enterprises in developing nations like these, where they promote commerce in these small communities as well as job opportunities. Yes, you're helping your local community and you're helping the world at large. 
If you're interested in doing a Shoe Drive fundraiser, make sure you click those links down below. We will provide you with all of your marketing materials and everything you need to get started free of charge. We want to help you just as much as you want to help your cause and as much as you want to help the world. So click those buttons. We hope you enjoyed those top five nonprofit fundraising ideas. My name is Christy. And my name is Eric. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. The matching con contribution areas. Think first, talk later. Is you. I wish I knew. That's the internet.